change uh, that, that these uh, past compositions have made to music, but this one made a huge change, not only to music, but to uh, the, uh, the geography of Europe, uh, frankly. And Sibelius, so important uh, to uh, Finland and the Finnish folk there that he, uh, not only does he have a huge national park, uh, they're dedicated to him. Uh, before the Euro came along, he was on their 100 mark bill, uh, which is, is a pretty big, uh, pretty big something uh, to do to get your face on uh, any kind of currency. Well, basically, throughout the 18th, well, for hundreds of years, that area of Scandinavia was uh, fought over. And throughout the 1800s, most of the time, it was controlled by Russia. Um, and the, the Russian czars had pretty much say what would go on uh, in the land that, that we call Finlandia now. That all kind of came to a head in about 1899 when Tsar Nicholas II passed an edict saying that Finland, Finland was to be ruled by Russia. Local governments had no say in what they would do. Well, this really stirred up a lot of feelings, a lot of sentiment, but, you know, what, do you, what can you do against the Tsar of Russia? Well, John Sibelius wrote uh, this piece, originally called Finland Awakes, uh, for a political rally. Actually, the political rally was, uh, was put on uh, by the Russians to try to get people a little bit more Russianized. Well, he wrote this song, and uh, to say the least, it inspired uh, the, the, the country of Finland to finally say, you know, that's it, this is our country, we're taking it back. It's called a tone poem. See, a poem in words is written to, you know, not necessarily take it through a story like prose, but to give you pictures, uh, and give you examples of what happens. And the same thing that Sibelius did here through the music. You can feel the impression at the beginning of this tune, and you can feel the triumph at the end of it. And it inspired uh, not only music from then on to uh, you know, be more depictive and be more emotional and energetic, but inspired Finnish people to say, you know what, this is our country and we're taking it back. And in 1917 they did, and since then Finland has been Finland under no other rule but their own. So thank you for coming to this concert tonight. We'd like to wrap up with Sibelius's Finlandia. <laughs>